Hi, my name is Andre Primus and I will be taking the next few minutes to walk you through the steps to download the Transit app and create an account for the new RTS Go payment method. I'll be using iOS in this video, but the app functions identically in iOS and Android, so these instructions should work for any smartphone. For more information on RTS Go, please visit myrts.com slash RTS Go. Let's get started. In order to install the app on iOS, you'll need to click on the App Store icon. Once you enter the App Store, you can search for Transit. You should see the green Transit app icon show up in your search results. Note that even though the app description does mention New York City, LA Metro, uh, and other transit systems, this is the same Transit app that will work with the RTS system. I'm going to click the down arrow on the cloud uh, in order to download the app. If you've never downloaded the app before, you may need to provide your iCloud password or your thumbprint in order to get in. Installation will be slightly different on Android. You can see that the app is downloaded because it says open. You can verify that by going to your home screen where you should see the green transit app icon. Click on the Transit app icon on your phone. You should see the RTS Go icon on the bottom of the screen. If you don't see it, you may need to click on the uh, Settings menu and look at the available services where RTS Go should be listed. In order to create your account on RTS Go, start by clicking Buy. Then click Pay with your mobile phone. In order to create a transit account, you will need an email address. Once you've entered your email address, please click Next. You will need to provide your first and last name. Then again, click Next. When you create a password, it will need to be at least eight characters long, including one letter and one number. You'll see that sign up is grayed out. I can't click on it. If I want to click on sign up, I'll first have to agree to the terms of use. Touch ID may be used with this app uh, instead of a password. If you would like to use Touch ID on your iPhone, please click Enable Touch ID. The next step it will ask you to do is to add your credit card. We will go over this in more detail in the next video, which is about how to refill your RTS Go account. For now, let's click Other Payment Options and hit Continue. Now we see that RTS has been added to our transit account. You're going to want to indicate your traveler type. RTS has different fares for children, seniors, and the disabled. I'm going to select regular. Once I've done this, I can close this out by hitting the X in the upper right corner. Now you can see that the RTS Go bar on the bottom has changed from saying buy to saying ride now. You've successfully created an RTS Go account. Now that you've successfully set up the app, you're ready to load funds onto your account, which we'll show you how to do in the next video. For more information on RTS Go, please visit myrts.com slash RTS Go and enjoy the ride.